Hi, Brenda Nicholas, painting for fun. Today we are going to be arting on some in my art journal and I ripped a page out because I want to use it as a background. And so sometimes when I am painting, I will use scraps of paper to kind of clean off my brush. This was some index paper that I had. So I kind of um, just, you know, smeared it on there. So we're going to do this on a bigger scale. So we're going to use this whole piece of paper because I need it for some scrap paper. So I had some colors, paints come over here. So you just kind of start swishing around. There's no really rhyme or reason. Just kind of use the colors that you like. And you're going to use this as a background color. So you're going to use it for whatever reason, really. And it's just fun to use the swipes, go back and forth. You can use, I'll show you how to use some things you might have around the house for stenciling. If you don't have some stenciling, like I said, you can use, um, well, I've used bottle caps. I've used a fork. I've used a paper towel roll. So lots of different ways that you can add dimension. Another way that um, I really love is using the splatter paints. And to splatter, get some water. So this is gonna be some splattering on here. One little boy in my class, my art class, that really likes to splatter. If you want more control, you can use the bottom of your brush and do some dots, which is fun too. Just to add a little bit of some different dimension. Another thing that's nice to do, and I'm going to use, I think I'm going to use this scroll. So I'm going to use this card that I have. I think maybe this one's a little bit thicker. So you can use a, um, kind of like a card that you might get in the mail or a credit card kind of thing, but I just have this handy, so I'm just going to fold it in half, make it a little bit thicker, and then I'm just going to add some color to the edge. Make some red, some yellow, and some white. Can you see that? So it's just going to be some little bit of we're going to scrape. So we're going to come down this way and scrape it down. So this kind of adds a little bit more dimension to it and makes it more fun. And it doesn't take so much time. So like I said, just have fun with it. Use um, whatever you have available to you. And what's going to happen is we're going to cut this up and um, make some cards with this. So this is going to be, let's put some more down here. So this is just going to be like a fun background. And we're going to add some more to it. So I think I'm going to add some more. I think I scraped all my sprinkles off. So let's add some more spots. And stay tuned. And I'm going to let this dry really good. And then we'll come back and I'll show you how I'm going to use it. All right, we'll be right back. 